Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews back with another video and today we have part 18 of the top 10 CD tweaks compatible with iOS 10 up to iOS 10.2. Switch is bored. This tweak is still on beta, but it's pretty awesome. So normally on iOS 10 on the lock screen, when you swipe like this, you will go to the camera. But with this tweak, you will get all these useful toggles. So you have here the Bluetooth, the Wi-Fi location services, you have the volume, the low power mode, and you have a lot of toggles that you can really use directly from the lock screen of your device. So you don't need even to unlock your device to turn on or off any of these features. So you to install this tweak, you will need to add a repo, which you will find in the description of the video. Banner music. This is a tweak for the music app. Once you start playing a song, it will show you a banner up here, which tells you which song is currently playing. So even if you're not on the app, if you're not on the music app, you can go ahead and just switch between songs and you can see every time it will show you a banner, which shows you the current playing song. 3D app lock. This tweak allows you to lock your apps from the 3D touch menu. All you have to do is just force touch on an icon and once you get here, the 3D touch menu, you can tap here, lock app, and it will lock that app using your touch ID. So you will have to enter your touch ID to unlock that app, or you can even add a passcode. So to do that, you go to settings, you enable the tweak right here, you can unlock all the apps from here. And then lower here, you can ch go to change passcode. And here you can enter a passcode, which you will use instead of the touch ID. If it doesn't recognize your touch ID, or if you don't have a touch ID device. Video pane. This tweak will enable picture in picture on your iOS 10 device. So while you're watching a video, you can double tap on it and it will detach that video and you can move it anywhere on the screen. So anywhere you go on your device, you will have your video and you can also resize it. So if you tap here, then you will get a bunch of controls here. So you have a pause button, you have the X button to close it and you can skip 60 seconds forward or backwards with these buttons right here. Spring Plus. This tweak is pretty awesome. It's kind of like a mini Spring Tomize 3 for iOS 10. So it adds a bunch of new features that allow you to customize the look of your iOS 10 device. So for example, here on the home screen, I can hide the labels. I can hide the background of the dock. If I go to the app switcher, you can see I have the status bar right there. I can remove the names and the icons of the app cards here on the app switcher and a bunch of new configurations here under the settings of this tweak so you have here all these sections so springboard lock screen notifications app switcher system wide and then system apps and you can go ahead and go to any of these sections and customize them the way you like type tab this tweak will add a nice little feature to safari so when you open a new tab on safari it will automatically place the cursor here at the address bar and will also open the keyboard of your device so normally you wouldn't get that you will have to tap on the address bar to put the cursor there and to show the keyboard but this tweak will do it automatically for you once you open a new tab Haptic Pro, this tweak will bring haptic feedback to all iOS 10 devices. So under the settings of this tweak, you can enable here the haptic feedback for the keyboard, for the buttons, for table cells, and also for web links. So pretty much anywhere you tap on your device, you will get a haptic feedback and lower here you can also set the duration of the haptic feedback with this slider. Icon tool, on the home screen of your device, you can swipe up or you can swipe down on, a, on an icon and it will show you the icon tool menu. So you can open it on the iFile, you can rename the icon, you can clear the badge of that icon, you can set a custom badge and you can rebuild all the icons. So pretty useful here, it adds a bunch of new features to the icons and you can manage them using the icon tool. Search delete, this tweak allows you to delete any of your applications directly from the spotlight search. So all you have to do is just search for any of your apps and just press on the icon of that app and you can delete it directly from the spotlight search show. So you will get the pop up here and you can delete it directly from here. Clear clock view. This is a simple one for the icon of the clock. So it will remove the icon and will show you just the current time. Under settings here, all you have is an enable button to enable the tweak and a reach spring button for the changes to take effect. So that's it for this video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the tweaks, for more videos like this make sure to subscribe, also don't forget to follow me on my social media, you will find all the links in the description of this video.